Hi everyone, welcome back to Melissa's Corner. I am Melissa. If it is your first time here, welcome. I'm so glad to have you. We've had a lot of new subscribers in this past week, week and a half. So I wanna welcome everybody who have subscribed and part of our YouTube family. Thank you so, so much. I appreciate it, I really do. Today, I just wanted to share a couple of things with you guys. Yesterday, I ran a few errands. I went to TJ Maxx, Sally's, and Target. So I'm just gonna quickly share with you some of the things that I picked up. One is I picked up this nail polish at Sally's Beauty Supply, and it is a Tiffany blue. I'm thinking it looks a little bit more blue blue, but it's supposed to be a Tiffany blue. So I went ahead, put it on my fingers, put it on my toes. So now my toes and fingers match, and I uh, wanted to share that with you. It's the brand OPI. I really love that brand there. Um, and then I ran into Target. And when our target, sorry, it was TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx is very, very affordable jewelry. If you look like sterling silver, you like gold, anything like that, um, or just costume, you know, plated stuff, um, they have it, everything. They have everything in many, many prices, but it's all really affordable. I picked up this sterling silver ring that has uh, amethyst inside. I don't know if you can really see the the shape of the amethyst there. But it sets a little high on the finger. It's a little bit wide here, but it's very comfortable. And it has that intricate um, scrolling uh, on the on the uh, band there. But it's nice and thin on the inside. So really, really comfortable, as you can see right there. So yes, I picked up this ring. Love it. That was at Target. And then I picked up this sterling silver ring. And this one has a emerald which is a raw cut on the top of it and it kind of wraps around you guys remember the old spoon rings i haven't had a spoon ring in so many years but i think it would be cool i would like to find a spoon ring i don't even know if they make them anymore but i think a spoon ring would be fun um that's what this kind of reminds me of but it's right there you can see it on it just kind of wraps around the finger it sets up a little bit um as far as the height that little stone, but it's very comfortable. So I picked up these two rings at TJ Maxx. Kicks and giggles, they were very affordable, didn't break the bank, just something cute and a little different to wear than the things that I normally wear. Um, since my nails are blue today, I'm wearing my large turquoise ring and my uh, sterling silver mother of pearl ring I have on here. So yeah, I got that. Um, went over to Target to pick up things. Target, you can spend forever in. I mean, ours has a grocery store. It has everything. It has a Starbucks. I could literally spend a couple of hours in there. It is so fun and so cool. Right when you walk in, they have all the Chotskys. You guys know what I'm talking about. You walk in and there's like Valentine's Chotskys, Easter, St. Patrick's Day, all the little Chotskys that they, they get you on when you walk in. Well, they had some of these cute little glass containers that has a seal on it so you can just pop it down or you could keep little candies in here little little snacks anything like that but I thought it would be really cute um, maybe sitting in here somewhere with my handbags or in the uh, bathroom on the counter or something with little you know little things that you have little hair things you take off your jewelry you can pop in here but it was five bucks I thought it was really cute and it's just this pale pale pink glass jar so I picked that up and they're jammies. I love their jammies. I mean, they're not expensive. They don't break the bank either, but they last and they are so soft. I like Walmart jammies too, but I got this. This is just a, let me see if I can get it in the right. It's just a night shirt. And the night shirt is really cute because it has a pocket on the front. It has long sleeves. It is so soft and so silky that you just want to just put it on and just you know relax and just flows over the skin love it so yeah i picked this up when i was there too and then the last thing i picked up okay you guys know i've been having a jean jacket problem my jean jackets i've had for i've had for years i really have i've had most of them for years with the exception of one or two the rest i've i've had a long time but right there, when you walk in past the Chotskys, they had uh, denim jackets. Of course, I had to look. So I looked at the denim jackets, tried them on. I was between two different ones. I picked this one. I got another one. 
So look at the back of it. I think it was part of their Valentine inventory. But it says, love always. Is that not cute? I just think it's really cute. I love red. I love red. I love red. And I love jean jackets, denim. Yes. So I thought maybe with um, a long skirt or a pair of capri pants and maybe some tennis shoes or little sandals. Really cute. I couldn't pass it up. And did I tell you the price? The price of this denim jacket, 38 bucks. 38 bucks for the I mean, this is a nice weighted denim. So um, they had them from little teeny tiny baby size, which I would have bought one for my little grandson, but they were oh, too small for him for the ones um, that they had available. But um, they just got the one for me and I just thought it was really, really cute. So yeah, that was my, my day yesterday of running around grocery shopping, doing you know this, that, and the other. But I found a few things to pick up. It didn't break the bank. Little Trotsky's jewelry, some clothing, some jammies. Just a little bit of this, a little bit of that. But, you know, I had to do it. I had to. The jean jacket was just like, don't leave me. And so I came home and I showed my husband I had another denim jacket. Yeah, but I told him the price. He says, oh, he understood at that point because the deal was too good to be true. So, when I got uh, everything situated last night, yes, Mr. DHL came again. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. And he bought this for me. So, we are going to do this in the next video. So, stay tuned. Hmm, what could it be? Could it be that other Aspinall? Because I think I have two in the works. Stay tuned. See what we've got in the box. Bye.